So I've been living with Helen for about 10 years now. And uh, her name's not really Helen Keller. I just call her that because, uh, you know, she's deaf, dumb, blind, and mute. So, and uh, I remember that Helen Keller character from uh, Little House on the Prairie, I think it was. I don't know. I get free rent to take care of her, but, you know, I worked a little. I worked it out a little bit. I did a little magic, and, you know, she takes care of me, you know, quite a bit, too. It's good for her, you know, exercise. Keeps her, uh, you know, keeps his lawn looking good. Keeps her in shape. Other way. And then I also got a series of uh, um, trails, like what I made out of rope, so she can find her way around the house and you know, do do the basic stuff you need to do. What's the hold up? Come on, Ellen. So <clears throat> I invented like a new uh, new linguistic um, language form that actually I'm trying to think about getting like patented. I can like, like, m like mush her face, like her mouth, like make it like, uh, you know, mold the words that I want. Like I use her face like, like, like putty, like Play-Doh. So I call it hanguistics. So I got her, t I actually got her talking. I got her saying a couple of phrases, like catchphrases, you know? And I got her to say, uh, I'm a whore, which uh, my brother comes over sometimes, drink some beers and, uh, he loves that. We, she just says, I'm a whore, I'm a whore. And that's like a fucking parrot. Fucking hilarious. I'm a whore. She thinks it's a squirrel. So like the center that takes care of her, they pay, they pay, you know, they pay for like little trips for me to get her out of the house and do stuff. But like I said, she don't know the fuck. She don't know the difference. I took, you know, it's, sometimes it don't matter. I shelled out like $150 to go parasailing. She probably thought we were at the grocery store. It don't, you know what I mean? We went down to uh, Ocean City there. Nice, Ocean City is classy. It's a nice place, you know. And uh, she almost fucking drowned. I told her, you know, I was at Allen, boogie boarding is not your sport, you know. You ain't got the legs for it. But she don't listen sometimes, you know. She's out there doing barrel rolls and... He's working on it, working on like round offs, uh, tumble tim, tiny touts, some dibble, double ding dangs. She's getting better, a little better. She'll stop. She's not always uh, real easy to deal with, you know, Ellen can be she can be a little tiger. She can be a real fucking class A bitch, too. And I can tell when she's angry because uh, she does like this thing. It sounds like, uh, kind of sounds like Chewbacca, like a Wookiee. She does like a Wookiee roar. And I can tell when she does a Wookiee roar. She's not, uh, <clears throat> she ain't too happy. We, we get, we, you know, sometimes it gets a little physical. And not, you know, not like Olivia Newton-John physical, you know, Ellen, like I'm talking WWE, now, WWF, oh. TNT, Nitro physical, you know. This is the feely phone. She can basically, she does like a thing where she just... Punches in and you know, then it, it sends me like a voice activated uh, message on my phone if there's an emergency. Oh, wait, there's someone coming in now. Help me, Tony. I broke my leg. She just broke her leg. Stupid ass. But I keep it I keep it turned off most of the time because it uses up my minutes on my plan. I don't got that rollover or none of that. So, so what I'm trying to do now, my neighbor. He works in, uh, he's like a graphic designer. He got some showbiz friends, and I'm trying to, trying to, you know, pitch a show so we can have like a reality show or like a spinoff, kind of like a, you know, like Boost Some Buddies or something like that with me and Helen. Because, uh, you know, so there's some funny, there's some funny banter 
that happens around the house quite a bit. And, you know, it could do anything with it. You could go, you could do a movie, you could do a, a DVD, you could put it on a, like a CD or like a, like a, um, I, I think Colin Farrell would be perfect for my role, but, you know, if Colin Farrell don't do it, like, I could probably play myself, you know, I don't know who, uh, I'm not sure who could play Helen, and, you know, Helen can't play herself, I don't know, I think if anybody could play, maybe, like, Helen, uh, would be, like, Helen Hunt, or, like, uh, Helen DeGeneres, I mean, I don't even know how old Helen is, really, I mean, I'd say she's probably, like, 50, or, like, I don't know, 30, Someone between 30 and 50, I think. It's good, she's catching on, you know? I mean, after 10 years, I gotta run around this place like fucking Roadrunner. She's fucking, you know, she's doing good. Helen's all right, she's a good kid, you know? I like to bust a cunt a little bit, but she's a good kid overall. You know, I just think, you know, everybody should have somebody, you know? <laughs> It's not illegal, you know? Nothing here is illegal. Nothing illegal is going on. I'm a whore! Yes, you are. Oh. 